Hello Leo, welcome to my channel. Welcome to this coming week's reading. For this uh, uh, reading, I'm going to be casting stones. I'll be divining from reading these lovely stones here. And then I'll be drawing out some cards towards the end. All right. Lovely Leos, let us begin. Leo, 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 Leo. Okay. Mm, Leo. Mm, first thing I see is uh, some of you may be punishing yourselves. This is what I'm seeing. It's very interesting. It's like you may have made some kind of accidental mistake or something, you know, but it's, it's not as big as you think at all, Leo. There's something, maybe I'm picking on, on a few people only, but don't punish yourself. No, there's no need. No one else is thinking anything negative of you. I see this now. No one is actually thinking anything negative. No one's actually thinking of whatever it is that you think you did that was bad isn't. Um, it's like sometimes your mind is playing, you know, it, it's like it, it kind of it, it wants to exaggerate, but there's no need to. There's absolutely no need to. I do see better sleep is coming and that's what you need, which is really good, better sleep. There is a chance encounter that I see with somebody that's going to make you very, very happy. Uh, could either be somebody from a blast from the past or just um, somebody, you know, that's just going to light up your day. It could even be a stranger. It's a chance encounter that you have, you know, and it just puts a smile on your face the whole the whole day. <laughs> they could say something that just really um, it changes your whole mood, and you do the same as well to them and to to other people. Um, there is something that. I do see prosperity. There's news coming in that's going to um, relieve a lot of your stress when it comes to your prosperity in terms of um, money or something that you've been looking to purchase. I do see possibly purchasing a car, um, but something you'll be relieved of some kind of stress, which is looking really good. I do see writing a book. Maybe this is a specific message, but there's something here about you writing a book, getting ready for it to be published soon. There's something like that happening. Um, I get you have a very diverse circle of um, friends that are very unique. Uh, this is what I'm seeing here. And you, um, that is like very much home to you. Um, you know, you get a, a, attracted to all sorts of uh, people from all sorts of backgrounds and you are a great chameleon in that sense, if that makes sense. You know, you can, you can, um, socialize really well with, you know, I don't know, royals. <laughs> And you can also socialize really well with, um, gosh, I don't know, with the circus team. That's so random. That's a terrible example. Oh my goodness. What was that? But anyway, it's like you, <laughs> you, and you have the best of both worlds, you know, you, um, there's something here that's going to you're going to use that to your advantage when it comes to some sort of interview you are fantastic when it comes to representing the best of you and people don't forget you when you go into that room if you have a meeting or interview of some kind they don't forget you you put a smile on lots of people's faces so this is really really lovely energy that i am seeing i do see some gift coming to you as well in terms of finances again Something is looking stronger and better for you in your situation when it comes to money as well. It's just looking stronger. And there's a lot of independence. You're wanting to be more independent. I do see this. You've learned to become more emotionally independent and, and all the rest as well. Um, could, some of you could be leaving a job. I do see you leaving a job and kind of like you're celebrating that. Painting the town red is what I see. Um 
there is something you've been manifesting that I see keys you've been manifesting something opening you know and, and there is some kind of like reason to celebrate here so you could be uh, reaching reaching this um, this part or that you know succeeding in in gaining uh, whether it's it's uh, some form of employment there's just this opportunity here that I do see many ways that you, you've manifested for yourself there is um, you've been a little bit there's some discomfort I see when it comes to somebody a little, feeling a little bit uncomfortable with someone but they I do see like they, something about changing habits, changing habits. Um, and if it was like more moderate, then you could like continue hanging out with them or, or being with them. But there's something <laughs> so random. <laughs> you gotta let me know if this is true. But if this is like resonates, there is some. It's like there's somebody that ha you can have a lot of potential being with them. But there's something about their habits that is like a deal breaker for you. But I do see there's a willingness for them to change. I mean, the habits could be so many different things. Um, yeah. <laughs> I would love to know what that's about. Okay. Let's see, Leo, what we have for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. The moon and the knight of stars. Or like the knight of wands. All right. The moon, the knight of stars. Lovely. Six of cups. Okay. The moon, the knight of stars, and the six of cups. Ooh. There is something I do see coming out of hiding. So, something that felt a little bit like it was in obscurity or you were waiting to hear about. And you do receive, I do get, again, some positive news. Something that's going to change. I do see... Um, uh, an exchange happening, some sort of exchange. It could be exchange of keys. It could be exchange of. Uh, th th there's something there that um, you know is looking. Something that has a lot of potential is looking very, very positive for you as well. But there, there it has been. I do feel like uh, it's been quiet for some time, and then it starts to um, unfold, and. There has been, I do get here with the Six of Cups, a dream that you have been keeping for a long time that's about to open up for you as well. Because I do get you are going to have the, the means or the ability to access something that has been a dream of yours. That could be um, traveling to a particular place that's always been a dream of yours. Um, you know, doing something that perhaps feels uh, adventurous. Nine of cups. Nine, nine of cups. And the two of swords. All right. Nine of cups and the two of swords. Mm -hmm. There's, I do see a change here in terms of, um, again, as I was talking about your means, your, your, your capabilities of doing stuff, but sometimes when you have what you want, uh, choosing things could become a bit more of a, of a struggle, you know, um, like it takes you longer to decide. That's just one thing that I'm getting. Um, and you're needing a bit more of a, a challenge or adventure of some kind. Um, so that's one thing. But I do also get, you know, um, this with the Nine of Cups, there is something that is coming through that's like music to your ears. Now you have to kind of really decide where you want to put this, where you, how how you want to take it forward. You know, where, you, where are you going to place... Um, your gold, you know, where do you want to invest what you have in? And I do see something is arising where you, you will be able to see it more clearer. Yeah, it's going to be a lot clearer for you. But there is something here that says to not um, uh, kind of uh, like jump the gun here. Listen uh, carefully to certain details and look into other um, ways of doing things. Just look into things a, a little bit more. 
and you're going to find exactly what you have been um, looking for. Perhaps without you even uh, realizing. A king of coins. Look, I told you finance is going to look pretty good. There is, uh, I do see somebody around you that's very smart. Um, and very kind of like sure of themselves, but also have a lot of um, faith in you. This is, I do see you could be coming across somebody like this. They have a lot of faith in you, Leo. Um, and there could be some sort of proposal coming towards you as well. There's an acceptance as well. You could be accepted into something, whether it's, you know, a school or a job. Um, you also are going to find um, the means to, I know it keeps repeating this, but something is going to be a lot more fruitful than you realize. You actually have more doors, doors open than you can see, that you think that you can, you can see. There's a lot more um, behind, happening behind the scenes. And there is something about trusting your gut. Um, and there is a figure here that I do see could be your peer, you know, fellow friend here. There's a there's good guidance. And if there's nobody physically, it is spiritually. But there is very good, very, very smart decisions you're going to come across. Something very smart that you're going to choose. You're going to stick by it. And it's going to make you very happy from that as well. So that's why he was also saying to trust your gut, Leo. Definitely love this for you. Mm -hmm. something about also uh, negotiations speaking speak what are your you have lots of thoughts and it's good to speak them out because there could be somebody that knows exactly what to do also with with what you are thinking about oh, i hope all of that made sense <laughs> Leo. thank you so very much for being here really really hope that this was helpful love you all so much do take care and until next time